Hey, welcome to Clicks and Quesadillas. This is Jason. This is Zach. Hey, how's it going, guys? Uh, we are about to, well, I am about to play in a tournament, a pre release for Batman, the animated series Hero Clicks set. I'm pretty excited about it. I'm pretty excited to watch it. So, that'll be interesting. Yeah, man. Thanks for being here. Yeah, of course. Um, <clears throat> so, what are you most excited about in this set? Um,. I guess some of the villains, some of the uh classic Jason. <laughs> Always in the bad guys. Some of the super rares look really awesome. Uh the super rare Bane looks mm. really cool. It looks like he's a good representation of um, you know, cuz Bane's really smart, yeah. but he's also really strong. Tactician, yeah. It looks like a good uh like amalgamation of what he's supposed to be. They didn't show that in the movie. <laughs> did no. not show that. They did not. Uh, yeah, I'm excited about that. There's a. Is there any sort of a strategy that you think you're going to have for this game? Do you, do you imagine most of it's going to be up close because a lot of the characters are going to have stealth. So, you know, is there certain pieces that you're really trying to look for? Yeah, that's going to be hard. I mean, I, I'd really hope to get, like, a, a stealth buster, like a Batman Beyond, or uh, I think there's one or two other things that, that help with busting stealth, but, uh, yeah, that could make things difficult, sure. uh, all the stealth. Um, get up close person. Yeah, we some good outwit. Hopefully, I'll find someone with somebody with prob. I think there's a Joker with prob. But now with prob and outwit, you you still are going to require line of sight, correct? Yes, it's true. So that's going to be. Well, no, not with prob. No, because stealth sort of turns off during. Oh, okay. When it's that for the active player's turn, their stealth is. Make sure bring it up. I can take advantage of. <laughs> No problem. So that's interesting. Um, what pieces have you seen that you're not looking forward to pulling? Is there any sort of just fillers you feel like? Yeah. Uh, well, yeah, there's some normal, like, human characters, like a Roland Daggett. Like a Batman. Crime boss. Because um, he's a human. <laughs> Got him. It's true, yeah. Batman's a human. Um, I am. I'm mixed about the chase pieces, the super friends. I mean, I don't really want to keep them, but if I get one, then I can sell it. So I'll make some of my money back, so that'll be nice. Um, <laughs> now, who all is it like Apache Chief? He is, Black Lightning? But not the others. I think Apache Chief is the only one that's well, like the oddball, not sure. in the comics. The whole issue. Hmm. What about um, keywords? Is there a chance that you can run a theme team? For oh, this? for sure. I mean, that would be good. There's like a, the any Gotham. New, any new names oh. coming out in this one? Or any names that you're excited that you can add on to like a pre-existing team, possibly? Uh, there's a Clayface Prime character. He, he goes on to any theme team. Oh, okay. So uh, that's kind of his, uh, that's his like, special power? Yeah, there's a super rare Clayface, but then there's a Prime Clayface. Do you remember we talked about Primes before? There's like purple and, rings. And they're green? But you were, you were thinking more along the lines of like an REV, yes. rookie experience veteran. Yes. It's not quite like that. Mm. So see, there's like a a common Batman, mm -hmm. and there's a prime Batman, the green circle, that's not called Batman. It's called Clayface. Oh. So they try to do something unique with like the sculpt that it's, the sculpt's the same, but it's like different. Mm -hmm. So there's also like a rare killer croc, but there's a prime killer croc that's Batman. Seal boy. We'll edit that out. Probably not, because oh. I don't edit stuff. <laughs> I remember from the Batman animated yeah. he friended a boy who was a seal. I do remember that. That's good. Good. Mm. Poor seal boy. Uh -huh. I just thought he had a friend. <coughs> but killer, killer 
Croc. He must be uh, he must be a pretty uh, pretty nasty character, especially for this sort of game. He's definitely up close. Beast. Uh, I think with Midway in his dial, he has a white power that um he can make three close attacks. That sucks. It plays close attacks. But I think he's just like straight up three damage. Oh. But I mean, most people in the game probably don't have. Uh, sure. Damage reducers. And now, do you know, are those three attacks, they have to be separate characters? Or no, you can, you can just make three attacks just outright. Oh, wow, yeah, that's, that's a good piece. Could that be uh, used? There's, a uh, like, two pieces I haven't seen, like, mm -hmm. stats for yet. One of them is a... Uh, a Batman piece, a super rare. I don't know what the others are, but there's something new in Hero Clicks that's like just maybe like the a year old is something called a title character. And you can have one title character on your force and like uh, they they accrue like plot points. So like I've seen there's a Batgirl that's a title character for the set, and she starts with two plot points. Every time she uses Perplex, she gets a plot point, but then she also has, like, things where give her a free action, it costs two plot points, and she can do this type of attack, or three plot points, and she can do this. Oh, it's kind of on the line of a Warhammer, where you have a hero, and that hero has special rules and you know, things that are wrong for that person. Um, now, you know, I, we did an injustice to the fans. We did discuss the tournament. So what type of tournament is this? Oh, How exactly is it going on? All right, so booster tournament, a five-figure booster tournament. I actually don't know if it's a draft or a, like, a straight-up you get right. the two packs. But, uh, so, if it's not a draft, I'll get the two five-figure packs, open them up, and I'll put together a 500-point team. It's 500. And then out of that, you keep what's in that pack compared sure. to a draft, which would be... A draft would be like, I open up my packs, I pick one, pass them to the left. Mm. So like somebody on my right is passing theirs to I me. I hate booster drafts. I love booster oh, drafts. No, not me. I don't like it because what if I get an awesome set? What if I pull a great boost? Like I, I paid the money. I want that. Well, you keep the best piece. I mean, you get a super rare whatever and you keep it. I just, I don't like it. I like it because I get to pick, I, I just pick stuff I want, usually. Oh, you passed that? Oh, you, they're, they're, well, I just want to win. <laughs> I'm not worried, I'm pretty skilled. Mm -hmm. I'm, uh, Zach got me these, uh, these dice from Megacon, and I'm going to use them tonight. Exciting. So I can blame him if they don't roll or okay. Yeah, I was going to say, yeah, let's, let's get a roll. Let's see what, see what they do for you. Eight, eight? That's solid. Yeah, that's good, that's good. Eight hit the gate. <laughs> was that off the top of your head? That was good. Good luck on your pulls. Um, Did you get the PR yet? Thank you. Nice. <laughs> um, Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Well, that's exciting. Um, so I think we're going to pause it here, and then hopefully we'll be able to restart it once Jason's actually opening his packs and give you guys kind of a peek at uh, what's all going on with that. Yeah, awesome. Thanks. Thanks for being here, Zach. Yeah, of course. No problem. Supporting me. Yeah. Someone has to. Monica. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, so this is what I pulled. No super rares, mm. but uh, this is the team that I'm putting together. Alright, I put some Batman with DC maps here. Very nice. Looks like he has a Robin Got rare. little flash. So you have another brick, right, Ron? And then, uh, <laughs> this is my other rare. He has a crab. Two boosters. So that's going to be really helpful. Yeah, definitely. There's no chase in it. She's so outwit. You know, mm -hmm. And poison. Really it's be like she prime. also has yeah. prob. Mm -hmm. Harvey Dent. Nice. And then uh, he can generate smoke clouds for free. So that's going to be useful for some of my Batman 
friendlies. No, no, don't roll. And then, uh, then I put these two on. They're not awesome, but I mean, it's what I got. I got two Commissioner Gardens. I got another one that's not on my team. So, uh, kind of an average pool, you would say, or below? Below, but the utility is good. The, sure. The, the price points. Price it, points seem nice. Yeah, it's it's. I think it's like five points under four hundred. We're mm. doing four hundred point game. All right. Wish me luck. And hey, here I am back home. So. The tournament didn't go so well for me. I won one out of my three matches. Uh, my first match was uh, definitely my rolls were a big problem for me. Uh, I played my friend Christian and it was still fun. It was good and uh, I think he felt sorry for me so he gave me this suited henchman that was on his team which is uh, one of the pieces that I'm gonna need to acquire. A few of these guys. Probably like four of them, but I don't know how soon that's gonna happen. Hopefully I get one at least in my brick. Uh, so, sort of showed you guys my team already. So it looks like there's, I, well I had three probability control people. I didn't realize there were so many uh, prob people in the set. So, Hopefully I'll get some more in my next pre-release. So, uh, the Flash, he was one of the ones with Prob. He was he's pretty good. He's one of my rares. I wanted to highlight, show show off some of the, the, the two rares that I got. And uh, Robin, he also had Prob. Um, he did really well for me, too. Uh, he only has Prob on his first click. Well, he gets it again. He skips it over. Flash has it on first three. Yeah first three clicks. Uh, so some of the pieces I didn't play were Lock Up. Uh, yeah, Incapacitate Barrier. Uh, probably I could have used Barrier more effectively on Commissioner Gordon. Uh, but I used Leadership a lot. Helped me a little bit. Uh, but I had two of him. I was able to trade one away to the judge, Ron, and he traded me a Batman, who I did not get. So that's cool. I um, <clears throat> also did not play DD because they work well with another DD, which I did not get. Um, so that's those are my pulls. Uh, later tonight, I'll be playing at Coliseum of Comics at Fashion Square. Maybe I'll get a super rare then, that's what I'm hoping for. That's what I'm banking for. Uh, for getting third place, that I got to pick this, uh, Cloak and Dagger from the, uh, Civil War OP kit. Uh, Mm hmm But uh Ron the judge he gave a, he gave out a bunch of stuff to me. I got two of these Green Lantern pieces. Uh one I'm gonna give to Will. And the other one <clears throat> I'm not sure. Also he gave me like a bunch of LEs, so it's like I like I feel like I won. I got this LE Captain Cold, which is one of the pieces I'm keeping. I got the LE Harley Quinn from the uh, release day Harley event. I'm just going to show Adam, Firestorm, Wonder Woman, uh, Simon Baz, Black Canary. I might keep her. Uh, Wonder Girl, I got two Harley maps, and uh, I'm not done yet. Uh, Ron gave me three Legion rings, and a Deadpool blank word balloon. 
yeah, I guess that's it. Uh, yeah, thanks to Ron, if you watch this. Hopefully he will. I'll probably post it on the Coliseum of Comics Kissimmee Facebook page. Um, comment, first person who comments, I'll give you this map if you want. I mean, the first person who comments that they want the map, I will give the map. Maybe you don't want the map, I don't know. Um, also the lantern. Can't be the same person. You can't be like, I want the map and the lantern. That's selfish. Come on. But yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. Hopefully I have some good news from tonight's pre-release. Thanks for watching.